Alrighty, made it out of there. Christmas Day. Check out the space wow for you. Right at the end of the shift, we were all sitting around talking. Somebody asked me about... I don't remember how we got on the subject. We got talking about space. Can a human being travel the speed of light? Uh, from everything I read, I think it, I think it would kill you, or you'd cease to exist. I don't remember for sure, but yeah. So let's say theoretically, it wouldn't kill you. So we're talking distances to galaxies and I don't know I'd have to sit down and really do some math but if you do 186,000 miles a second how far could you travel in a year um, I think my biggest question is could a human being travel a light year, the distance of one light year, in a natural fan of life using the current fastest speed that we know of? I think the answer to that is no. So, what, what's the closest uh, other solar system? Isn't that like something like 20 light years? Mm. 20 light years, so let's say how many generations is that? I mean, we can say. Each person will live to be a hundred just to use round numbers. I don't think any of my calculators will even cover that. That amount of uh, digits. That's probably a question for RC-62. He is probably, him or Chuck, you guys are probably smart enough or probably have a calculator that would be able to figure out, figure all that out. And then I got asked the question, if you're in a spaceship and you got windows and you're traveling the speed of light, <coughs> can you see light? And I thought about it for about 10 seconds and I said, well, I think you could see light coming at you. But if you turned around or looked in your rearview mirror, you would not see any light behind you because it wouldn't be fast enough to keep up. Or maybe you'd have to be going faster than the speed of light. 
I don't know. But when I answer that, <coughs> I had one guy that jumped right in and said, yeah, I think you're right. And then I had like three other people that were just like, wow. So, if you're smoking dope, there's one for you to contemplate. Think about that one. I'm just not that big of a math guy that I'd be able to figure out all the math on that. Cause you probably have to use 10 to the 19th power or some shit. And I, although I know what that is. Um, I don't have a calculator that's going to deal with that. That's one of them. That's one of them Texas Instruments super <coughs> super duper one they use in colleges. I had one in high school. Had all one button tangent and cosine. So I'll probably wait till later on this week to post this because I know nobody's going to watch it today because you're all busy with your family. And my PVC vid from this morning will say Merry Christmas to y'all and all that, all that good stuff. If any of your family left home all, I know they're all safe, so that's a good thing. We had zero incidents today, so which that's normal. We don't normally have any incidents. 